The Life and Legacy of Hazrat Umm Kultum bint Muhammad In the arid lands of ancient Arabia, where the relentless sun painted the dunes golden, and the nights were adorned with stars that whispered stories of old, a beacon of hope and purity shone brightly. Her name was Hazrat Umm Kultum bint Muhammad, may Allah be pleased with her, a woman of unwavering faith and sublime character whose life was a testament to the enduring strength of the human spirit. Born into the noblest family, the daughter of the final prophet, her existence was destined to be intertwined with the divine message that sought to transform the hearts and minds of humanity. Hazrat Umm Kultum grew up in the bustling city of Mecca, where the air was thick with the scent of spices and the echoes of merchants haggling over fine silks and precious gems. Her home, however, was a sanctuary of serenity and wisdom, graced by the presence of her parents, Prophet Muhammad peace be upon him, and Khadijah bint Kuwailid. From a young age, Umm Kultum was enveloped in an environment of love, compassion, and unyielding faith, traits that would define her life and legacy. The early years of Umm Kultum's life were marked by the profound spiritual awakening that her father's prophethood brought to their community. As Islam began to take root, the family faced immense persecution and hardship from those who clung to the old ways. Yet, through every trial and tribulation, Umm Kultum remained steadfast, her heart fortified by the teachings of her father and the unwavering support of her mother. She learned that true strength lay not in physical might, but in the resilience of the spirit and the purity of one's intentions. The trials of life, however, were not confined to external threats. The death of her beloved mother, Khadija, left a profound void in her heart, a void that only deepened with the loss of her siblings. Umm Kultum's elder sisters, Zainab and Rukaya, both succumbed to the harsh realities of life in those tumultuous times, leaving her to shoulder the burdens of grief and responsibility. Yet, in the face of such sorrow, Umm Kultum found solace in her faith and the unwavering support of her remaining family. Her marriage to Uthman ibn Affan was a union blessed by her father, the Prophet. Uthman, known for his piety and generosity, became her steadfast companion, sharing in the joys and sorrows of life. Their marriage was not just a union of two souls, but a bond that strengthened the fabric of the early Muslim community. Together they embodied the principles of Islam, their home, a beacon of light and guidance for those around them. The years that followed were filled with both moments of joy and deep sorrow. Um, Kultum and Uthman faced the loss of their children, a pain that pierced their hearts but never shattered their faith. Hazrat Um Kultum bint Muhammad did not have any children who survived infancy. In every moment of despair, they turned to their Creator, seeking solace in prayer and the remembrance of Allah. Um Kultum's resilience was a testament to her unwavering belief in the divine wisdom that governed their lives. As the community of believers grew and Islam spread beyond the confines of Mecca, Umm Kultum's role evolved. She became a pillar of strength and guidance for the women of the early Muslim community, her wisdom and compassion earning her a place in their hearts. She taught them the importance of patience, the beauty of humility, and the power of unwavering faith. Her life was a living example of the teachings of Islam, a beacon of light in a world often shrouded in darkness. The bond she shared with her father, the Prophet Muhammad peace be upon him, was one of profound love and mutual respect. He often sought her counsel, valuing her insight and wisdom. In her presence, he found a reflection of the strength and resilience that defined his own mission. Um Kultum's life was a testament to the profound impact of a father's love and guidance, shaping her into a woman of unparalleled virtue and grace. The twilight of Umm Kultum's life was marked by profound sorrow and loss. The martyrdom of her beloved husband Uthman during the turbulent times of political unrest left her heartbroken. 
The sight of his lifeless body, a victim of treachery and betrayal, was a wound that time could never heal. Yet, even in her grief, Um Kultum remained a pillar of strength for the community, her faith unwavering and her spirit unbroken. As she lay on her deathbed, the memories of her life's journey played like a poignant melody in her mind. The laughter of her children, the wisdom of her father, the love of her husband, and the trials they faced together all converged into a symphony of faith and resilience. Surrounded by her loved ones, she breathed her last, her soul returning to her Creator with the same purity and grace that had defined her life. The legacy of Hazrat Umm Kultum bint Muhammad endures in the hearts of those who remember her story. Her life, a tapestry woven with threads of love, sacrifice, and unwavering faith, continues to inspire generations. She taught us that true strength lies in the resilience of the spirit, that the trials of life are but a means to purify the soul, and that unwavering faith in the face of adversity is the greatest testament to one's character. In the sands of time, her name remains etched as a beacon of hope and inspiration, a reminder that even in the darkest of times, the light of faith and love can guide us through. Her story is a testament to the enduring power of the human spirit, a legacy that will forever inspire those who seek to walk the path of righteousness and faith. And as we remember her, our hearts are filled with both sorrow and gratitude, for in her life we find the embodiment of the true essence of Islam, a journey of faith, love, and unwavering devotion.